Tetris Effect Connected has you playing the Tetris game we all know and love, but in a new dimension, in VR. Playing Tetris has always been an enjoyable puzzle game, but now it's a musical puzzle adventure as you explore different music and transcend into exciting new environments as you progress. Hello everyone, my name is Corey, and in this series we help you answer the question if Tetris Effect Connected is worth it. As always, we talk about the good stuff, the bad stuff, and then I give you my opinion, and I tell you whether I think it's worth it. So let's get right on into it. Before we get too deep into it, I want to make a quick note that I'm sharing video of Tetris Effect being played in VR as well as on flat screen. The game is exactly the same, so the flat screen gameplay footage is simply for your viewing pleasure. But I will show plenty of VR footage as well. The first thing you notice when stepping into Tetris Effect is the vast dark canvas. The big screen beyond showcases this even more with its true OLED blacks, which make bright neon particle effects light up like a fire in the night. Visually, Tetris Effect is stunning, with its vibrant particle effects and simple yet captivating environments. In the PC version, you have access to various VR graphic settings, including particle effect volume and size, and various other settings to tinker with. I had no problem running epic settings, and things look wonderful when you're immersed, in a flow state, and you see particles dancing around you while you drop blocks to the rhythm of the music. We will talk more about this later. The gameplay is exactly as you would expect from a Tetris title. Outside of the main campaign, there's an effects mode as well that lets you play in environments that you already know you enjoy, to better suit your mood. And this also allows you to play various challenging game modes. There's cross-play multiplayer as well, which allows you to either work cooperatively with other players to defeat an AI boss, or compete directly with other players to really put your skills to the test. There are various competitive game mode types, all with different rule sets to follow, including tournament-style battles if you're ready to compete at high levels against some of the best Tetris players in the world. The campaign in Tetris Effect has you progressing through increasingly more difficult levels as you venture through their entrancing musical environments. This is the bread and butter here. The sound design is brilliant, and really what makes Tetris Effect shine. What's unique about this Tetris game is that the music is rhythmically connected to your movements. That's hard to say. This means that every time you move, rotate, and place a block, you are contributing to the musical element, which makes you feel connected to the game. This is something that's so powerful that it makes you pick up your gameplay rhythm naturally, and this ensures that you are energized when things start to get faster as the music intensifies. Alright, remember those particle effects? They dance around and react to the music as well, which keeps things feeling dynamic and exciting as you venture through each level. Ultimately, the musical connection is what makes you feel connected with Tetris Effect Connected. There are a good collection of settings and options to tinker with and adjust, so you shouldn't have any issues getting things set up to your liking. You can remap your controls to meet your desires, so you can play how you enjoy. There is potential for motion sickness. Some people have trouble looking at a screen while in a moving car, and in Tetris Effect you are sometimes put into environments that have you traveling forward, which may cause the same effect of driving in a moving car while you're looking at a screen. This may cause motion sickness for those who experience this, so I thought it may be worth mentioning. There is a lot on offer here, and if you are a Tetris fan, then I think it's hard to be disappointed with Tetris Effect Kaka. Connected. Oh, those aren't the cacas, those are like hoo, 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 hoo. Or I mean hoot hoot. Even if you are like me and you're a casual Tetris player, or you haven't played much Tetris at all, I think Tetris Effect Connected in VR can lure people in who would otherwise not have played much, and create new Tetris fans. I am surprised every time I play Tetris Effect Connected. The music maintains rhythm, and having it react to what I'm doing in the game keeps things exciting, and it's quite a meditative experience when you get in the zone and focus on completing a more challenging level. The unique environments and captivating particle effects keep things feeling fresh and new as you progress deeper into more challenging levels. And with so many different game modes, you will surely always have something to keep you busy. Tetris Effect Connected is awesome, and I think it's well worth it. But I'm more curious whether you think it's worth it. Let me know in the comments down below, or to the side, or wherever they are now. If you want to see more videos just like this, make sure to subscribe and get notified when I post new videos. Liking this video does help a ton, and it shows your support. And if you want to know what's on my mind, then follow me on Twitter. Links are in the description down below. As always, make sure you think for yourself, which means question yourself, 
do what makes you happy, and I'll see you all next time. Oh, I messed up. scenes.